So first of all, I think there are some fields where you can be a clinician, a dentist, or, or a physician and still have research, but it has to be quite specialized uh, because research is, is so, um, you, ha you have to spend so much time uh, both doing the research and getting funding. Uh, there are fields like genetics where you could be a counselor for a particular you know, genetic uh, clinic or I think another one um, is anesthesiology. They're often there's time because uh, you, you, you don't have a clinic where patients are depending on you to be around and available. So there are a number of specialties. Um, I never specialized. As I said, I was going to be a cardiologist, which would not have been a good specialty for doing basic research. Uh, so as a, as a physician, so I was a, a, both a basic science department and a, and a clinical department, so I had to do some attending. Um, and I usually did one month a year. And I kept doing that until um, uh, I was also moonlighting, as I mentioned, in, in emergency rooms. And it was really the moonlighting that kept my skills up. So when my wife finished medical school and residency about eight years into our time in, uh, at Stanford, I, had, I, didn't have to, I didn't have to moonlight anymore. And then I felt uh, my one month a year, really, I wasn't as sharp as I used to be. And I felt like I was maybe going to make mistakes. So then uh, it was about 1998 that I, I decided I, I should quit. Uh, 